The Trump administration is announcing new rules which will deny green cards to anyone getting federal assistance. If they are not challenged in court, the new rules would go into effect in October. Natalie Brand explains the new proposal. The Trump administration has issued a new rule which could make it harder for legal immigrants who may need public assistance to become citizens. A poor person can be prepared to be self-sufficient. Many have been through the history of this country. Federal law currently requires people seeking green cards and legal status to prove they won't be a burden to the U.S. or what's called a public charge. The new rule expands the definition of public charge to immigrants using government benefits, including housing, food stamps, and some Medicaid coverage. And what we're looking for here are uh, people who are going to live with us either their whole lives or ultimately become citizens uh, who can stand on their own two feet. Sarah McTarnahan of the Urban Institute has been looking at the potential impact of the rule change. Oh, public benefits exist in this country for a reason and they're a really vital support to low-income working families. The Trump administration says the rules will not impact immigrant children who are U.S. citizens, but researchers say it will likely keep immigrants who need help from asking for it. Even though the rule hasn't been active or applied, we've already been seeing uh, immigrants kind of change their decision making about use of public benefits. Um, and I think starting to see some early impacts of that as well. The newly defined rule is set to go into effect October 15th. Natalie Brand, CBS News, the White House. Immigration advocate groups say they plan to file a lawsuit challenging the new public charge rule.